foreign secretaries from EU member states cannot foresee sanctions being imposed against Russia, which supports the Assad regime currently conducting a renewed bombing campaign in Aleppo. Meeting in Luxembourg to discuss the worsening humanitarian crisis in the besieged Syrian city, politicians said that sanctions are not the only tool at their disposal. The European Union doesn't only have sanctions in its toolbox. We have many other instruments we can use. Uh, we have the instruments for pressure. Uh, we also have leverages for good. Uh, and so a good mix of the two, uh, I think, uh, is always uh, wise and useful. On peut pas fermer les yeux sur cette... We cannot ignore this situation. Everything is being done to make us keep quiet and shut our eyes, but that will not be the point of this meeting. The solution to this, the, the future salvation of Aleppo, uh, lies really with the uh, Assad regime and above all with the Russians. It's, it's up to them to pull the plug on this thing, to see sense, and I appeal to the, the greatness of the Russian people to choose a different path. The siege of Aleppo has begun anew in the weeks following the breakdown of a short-lived U.S. and Russia brokered ceasefire. Much of the rebel held east of the city has been reduced to rubble, and food and medical resources are in short supply.